गुड इवनिंग एवरी वन टूडे इज़ आवर सेशन नंबर फिफ्टीन और बेटर टू से आवर लास्ट सेशन ऑन दिस पर्टिकुलर टॉपिक यूजिंग गोल्ड वेब विथ स्क्रीन रीडर नाउ इट्स बीन अ लॉन्ग जर्नी आई हैव कनेक्टेड टू यू फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम लॉन्ग पीरियड ऑफ टाइम इन द मीड आई हैड टू लीव इट फॉर अ मंथ और मोर देन अ मंथ एक्चुअली बिकॉज ऑफ माई डिजीज एंड ऑल so it's a it's a long journey 15 session it's a long journey now first of all i thank you everyone who joined so far and some of you who have joined all of my sessions uh it it actually helps me it it motivates me a lot that you people and i know you personally you people are so busy and still you joined my all of classes and i'm very thankful to you uh, i'm kind of a little emotional today uh, because it's you know it's a journey it's a friendship has been built with you now today as it is our last session so we have a little thing left we haven't uh, spoken about voice over yes we have you know we have de- demonstrated the effects and all but the last day if you can remember that we have uh, processed a vocal a song from the beginning to the end and today we will kind of do the same thing with a voice over so that is our focus topic and i also take questions from you and maybe at the end i i want some suggestions or whatever you think of this thing of the whole course or maybe you can suggest me something for the future you may suggest me what are the things you you found uh, from my side which i need to improve so all of this i want to know from you because this is the closing session but before that as it is we will go through our q and a session so if you have anything to ask feel free to ask me yeah as i was uh, asking you uh, uh you know before we started this session you know when you are using the loudness effect uh there is uh, this checkbox that we need to fill where it says uh, do not process if there is a voice breaking uh, the exact word again i forgotten what it is exact uh do not process or check box uh break the voice or whatever uh, that that particular point where you have uh, because uh, when when the voice becomes loud uh there's a chance of uh, the voice being impacted so uh can you just revisit and what is the meaning of this uh, impact of this uh, you know uh, on on the recording okay fine good question now first of all again i am just uh, recalling everything like when we have done the maximizing volume thing or better to say the normalizing stuff what normalization does it actually looks for the loudest part of the audio it measures like how loud it is and then depending on the uh, parameter it increases or maybe decreases the volume to match with that what do i mean let's say i have recorded something and there is a click and that is the loudest uh, you know sound of my whole audio which is let's say minus 6 db and then i have asked gold wave to normalize to minus 1 db that means it will increase the volume by 5 db to match the loudest part of my audio to minus 1 now when we process or when we record our audio you know we may have some accidental clicks like this or maybe in one word maybe in one sentence i was too loud so boosting volume using the normalization met- method does not give us the proper loudness which we want so that is why we make a kind of average loudness of our audio and previously we were we were using a method called rms but nowadays LUFS or loudness unit full scale is the newest method which we use it be- basically measures the audio and bring out an average loudness of the particular audio now i have already you know stated that there are some you know industry standard values you know for example for the vocals i mean complete tracks vocals uh, vocal music etc i mean song Uh, people used to you know go with minus 12 dv lufs sometimes even minus 11 dv uh, lufs for the voice and podcast stuff 
people prefer minus 16 some people even prefer minus 18 even some people prefer minus 20 okay so there's a, this type of industry standard now say i have a piece of audio i have recorded an interview uh, of maybe 30 minutes long now if i try to increase the audio the vo volume of the audio using the normalization method or maximize volume method maybe in those 30 you know a whole audio 30 minutes of audio i may have you know uh, spoken one sentence sentence or two very loudly like wow that's very good and then i have something like see so what 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 did you do in in your school life so see only that particular sentence wow that's great was too loud so when we are doing dealing with the maximized volume or normalization it only scans or finds the loudest portion of the audio according to that particular sentence okay so if we let's say find that our average loudness is minus 20 okay after recording the whole interview after doing everything uh, you know adding effects blah 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 if we find that okay my my loud my my max average loudness not maximize ma maximum loudness my average loudness is minus 18 now i can increase the volume using the loudness option or loudness tool in our effects section now let's say we have uh, increased it by some db to make it minus 14 or maybe let's say minus 15 so previously it was minus 20 now i wanted to make it to minus 15 okay now obviously it has increased the volume now while increasing the volume it may find something but it may find that okay everything is fine even after increasing the volume to match with minus 15 lufs audio average or volume average my maximum peak or the loudest part of the audio is let's say minus 1.5 that is fine but if there is an, any loud like or hey or something like that and it crosses 0 db 0 db crossing means it is actually clipping then what it will do if, if it, it, it finds that okay if i increase the volume to match with the average loudness of minus 15 then i am finding that my maximum volume is crossing 0 db that means clipping then what it will do we have three options one i may allow clipping that means okay let let it let it be plus plus two no problem or uh, uh, that means let it cross zero db no problem i'll allow clipping that's one option second option is mm, like okay if it is cr trying to cross zero db i'll adjust the value of my average loudness so that it doesn't cross zero db so let's say i have asked cold wave to match with minus 15 lufs but it finds that if it if it if it does the same then my maximum volume will be plus two then maybe it will uh, kind of normalize or you know maximize or make the loudness as minus 16.5 okay just to avoid clipping even i have asked it to you know match it with minus 15 db lufs but as my audio was clipping about to clip it makes it to minus 16.5 so that it doesn't cross zero db that is the second option and the third option is about processing that means it will tell me okay see you have asked me to increase the loudness to match it to my min, uh, minus uh, 15 db lufs but see it is clipping so i'm not doing anything i'm abouting the process so these are the three options now the question is what to choose now you know uh, what i personally do most of the times like i first allow it to be clipped okay so maybe because i know that maybe one or two sentences maybe one or two words is actually crossing zero db so first i allow it to be clipped okay and after the loudness uh, i'm applying the loudness uh, tool i apply a, a limiter okay so it scans the file and when it finds okay it is crossing zero db it turns down the volume to so that it doesn't cross zero db so if you allow it to be clipped make sure that you have applied a limiter then you will find no problem okay but if you don't allow clipping then fine if you if you if you say like okay so uh, that, then you can only go with maximize volume also okay because you are allowing clipping so you are not basically increasing the volume that much so 
you can go with the maximize volume option or normalize option as well so what is the bottom line bottom line is the best approach which i find is go with allow clipping and then after applying the loudness apply the limiter so that whatever crossed zero db it will fix that fix them okay yeah so uh so this lufs is the only parameter which you can actually in that in that effect uh, dialogue that you can kind of change like for example it's showing us minus 22 you can put it as 16. yes uh but the lra the maximum peak and things you can't specify right it, it will it will uh, it will kind of relate to what your luf is LUFS yes. is yes 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 you cannot change you can just yeah. come to know about this okay so that yeah. is my maximum blah 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 but you cannot change yeah. or do anything with that yeah there are three things that they three numbers that they show there uh, yes three or four numbers the fourth one i think is the time ah. uh, uh, and time is what the length of the they're showing the length of the piece or what's no, that where, time where showing? Where is it the showing? Ma maximum clip or maximum peak is there okay that is being shown yes okay Okay, because I, I I tried aborting using the abort function, and then suddenly I found that it could not it, it refused to apply. Yes. It says it uh, you know uh, uh, that means there are uh, clippings, uh, there are um, uh, sounds which are beyond zero, and that's why yes, it, yes, right. So right. if I had said uh, now limiter is not there as part of uh, the, the 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 gold wave package, so I think that's something which I will need to download yes. and. Yes, yes. Add on. Yeah. Okay. Thanks. Understood. Thank you. Okay. So today uh, you are talking about voiceover, right? Yes. So actually, uh, I want to know if you uh, give me a scratch. Suppose I've got three or five, three or four audios from various persons to make an audio story. So then. Uh, what is the process actually I need to do? Just give me a scratch which can help me to produce as much as better quality. So Okay, we will come there today. Okay, okay. I'm not answering okay. your question right now, but we'll come there. Okay. Is there any question from anybody right now? Are you answer none. None question for me in my side. Okay. So, fine, let me move to my focus topic today. First of all, you know, last day my audio was too bad. I was suspecting that actually maybe me or maybe someone else in my house accidentally increased the uh, compressor. I mean, there is a, uh, an analog gear. Maybe somebody, maybe uh, there are, you know, children in my home. So maybe uh, they have increased the compressor knob. So I sounded pretty bad in the last session i was suspecting that but uh, you know didn't catch up pretty well other than that i could fix the same anyway so while i'm talking about voiceover one thing i must uh, you know tell you like these days we have to do a lot of meetings a lot of online classes conferences etc etc so one thing i'll uh, suggest you or ask you to do like how you are sounding while you are on a zoom call or maybe google meet or someone uh, somewhere else like for example i found today ratul is fine but most of the case especially in the last day ratul was too loud he was clipping and i had had to you know uh, listen the whole one hour and 45 minutes of file to find where ratul is speaking so that i just, I just turned it down and i had to turn it down by 8 db can you imagine so still Rathul was not sounding good because he was clipping. So what I'll suggest first, please take some of your friends and arrange a Zoom meeting and you will be the host so that you can record yourself and then find that, okay, how loud you are in compared to other, how, how you are sounding. And also you can just open the same file in your gold wave and try to find that what is your maximum loudness over there. Okay. Uh, so that is something you need to be very careful about um, because you know being a voiceover artist as well I always try to make my voice sounds good if I could see then obviously uh, I could try to you know make my camera adjust properly so that I look good but as that is not the case uh, as I can only hear I can only listen my own voice so I can just try to adjust my voice even if I don't have the you know uh, uh, 
better gear expensive gear still i can just adjust my microphone volume properly i can adjust the distance of my microphone properly so that i sound good so that is something i'll uh, uh, just uh, request you people to do uh, most of you are fine but some of you have uh, seen sometimes that you are sometimes you are too low sometimes you are over loud sometimes you are clipping which is not that good now voiceover again just like a uh, vocal it has a vast area and different time different situation you need to process it differently i don't have the opportunity to you know demonstrate everything but first i'll discuss some cons or some something which is not industry standard which i used to see uh, my friends are doing and you know what i i'm going to say i have seen so many tutorials so many podcasts which has been done by my friends and uh, they put lot of reverb in it which is too bad you just listen any one of the professional podcasters podcast okay they don't apply such reverb a lot of reverb yeah you may apply reverb that's a different topic but i'll i'll, I'll come there as, as well but most of the cases when you are specially uh, recording in tutorial or something like that you shouldn't apply a lot of reverb which is really very bad okay and second thing is obvious your sound i mean volume or loudness is not uh, industry standard sometimes you are too loud sometimes you are not enough loud and the next problem is obvious a lot of noise that is something uh, it's not always in your hand i know but that is something which actually makes your sound less professional now first i'll play some of my voice over i'm i'm not saying that i'm the best voice over artist uh, of the world but i'll play some voice over just to let you just hear that and uh, unfortunately as i am a bengali and uh, i'm a bengali voice over artist i don't do a lot of english voice overs so uh, i'll just play some of uh, some of the bengali voice overs which i have created so those who uh, doesn't know bengali you can you cannot understand what i'm speaking but i'll give you the context you can hear you can hear it so this is a uh, one of the voice over now this voice over has been recorded for a radio and uh, for a special program okay so the program will be there from 10 pm to 12 am and uh, uh, in this particular program it is a it is an emotional program actually people will come and there share their problems their personal issues and maybe ask suggestions from the experts so it's a kind of psychological background so these voice over i had to do a uh, kind of in a very emotional tone and the background uh, music bed has a little bit of emotion in it so what i did i applied a little bit of reverb not that much a little bit of reverb because it is a kind of emotional thing if i had to record something okay you are listening to dance dance okay then obviously i'll not apply the reverb now see how much reverb i have applied there manusher jibon bornomoy ei bornomoy jibone emon onek ghotonai ghote ja smriti hoye basha badhe manusher mone tader mon theke muche phela kothin karo sathe bhag kore neyao pray oshombhob moner kumod ghore bondi hoye ora adhoirjo hoye othe moner jalnar kaaj bhenge chhoriye porte chay neel akasher buke আবার ধরো সেই সমস্ত প্রশ্নেরা যারা ভয়ে লজ্জায় অভিমানে কোনো দিন তাদের উপস্থিতির জানান দিতে পারেনি মনের ঘরেই যাদের রাত দিন বিশৃঙ্খল আনাগনা তাদের সবার জন্য এক উজ্জ্বল আকাশ নিয়ে হাজির হব আমরা প্রতিদিন রাত দশটা থেকে বারোটা আমরা থাকছি তোমরা থাকছো তো নাম প্লেইং ওয়ান মোর ভয়েস ওভ উইচ হ্যাজ বিন রেকর্ডেড using mobile's microphone because i was not there in my home and it was very emergency so i had to record using my mobile i didn't have any microphone with me so i have recorded using a very cheap quality mobile device and then add music it is it's an announcement of a particular program which will going to occur maybe 2 or 3 days later 
So listen this. Your attention please. Salt Lake Sector 5 Kolkata community is celebrating the Earth Day on 21st of April 2017. Yes, what did you Salt Lake Sector 5 Kolkata community is celebrating the Earth Day on 21st of April 2017. The corporates, NGOs and schools are the same as the people who are the same as the people who are the same as the people who আগামী 21 এপ্রিল 2017 সকাল 10টা থেকে সন্ধে 6টা সল্ট লেক সেক্টর 5 ইনফিনিটি বেঞ্চমার্ক কলকাতা 91 আমরা সবাই থাকছি আপনি থাকছেন তো সো সি আই हैव অ্যাডেড সাম কোরাস জাস্ট জাস্ট টু ইউ নো দিস ইজ ইট এনকারেজিং থিং সামথিং নাও আই এম নট টিচিং ইউ হাউ টু ইউ নো ডু প্রপার ভয়েস ওভার আই এম ট্রাইং টু টিচ ইউ দ্যাস দ্য সাউন্ড ডিজাইন হুইচ you can you may wish to follow okay so there i have added you know some kind of chorus i i didn't add any reverb in it okay i have compressed the voice a lot so it sounds punchy because it is already recorded using a very cheap i think a 6000 rupees mobile phone i was using in that time okay so that is something the next voiceover maybe the last one now this is something which is very <laughs> different than what i usually do now this voiceover has been recorded for a magic show. So a group of magicians asked me to do this. Actually this voiceover will be played on stage and uh, with the voiceover they will show the magics. Okay. And there is a theme of this magic to save the trees, to save the green. Okay. Now see, it's a live program. Okay. It's, it, it sounds like someone is actually speaking on stage and you know that when you are dealing like you are anchoring some you know live programs or uh, maybe uh, reciting something uh, on stage with a live audience you know in that cases you need to use a little bit of reverb so just listen a little bit of this Kobimon. <laughs> ঊনবিংশ শতাব্দীতে দাঁড়িয়ে এই চরম সত্য উপলব্ধি করেছিলেন অথচ আজ একবিংশ শতাব্দীতে প্রবেশ করেও আমরা ক্রমশ সেই সত্য থেকে দূরে সরে যাচ্ছি একটি গাছ শুধু একটি প্রাণ নয় একটি গাছ সহস্র প্রাণের সমান সৃষ্টির সেই আদি থেকে জীব জগতের বেঁচে থাকার সমস্ত রসদ জুগিয়ে এসেছে উদ্ভিদ আর তার বিনিময় আমরা কি দিয়েছি শুধুই অবহেলা একদিকে প্রাকৃতিক জঙ্গলের ধ্বংসলীলা আর অন্যদিকে কংক্রিটের জঙ্গলের মহিরুহ মহার্ঘ হয়ে উঠছে আমরা কি বুঝি না আসলে আমরা নিজেদেরকেই ধ্বংস করছি সভ্যতাকে ঠেলে দিচ্ছি উল্টো পথে সো ইউ নো ডিপেন্ডিং অন দ্য সিচুয়েশন টাইপ অ্যান্ড ওয়ার ইট ইজ গোয়িং টু বি ইউজড ইউ নিড টু ডিজাইন or arrange your sound today as i'll demonstrate the voice over now i'll record something maybe i have not planned anything i don't have any script okay so i'll record something uh, which just comes to my mind now uh, while doing or recording voice over that is something uh, please share your jaws with us yeah yeah obviously i'll do now you know those who who are there you know as professional voice over artist uh, now you know that to do the proper voiceover you need to learn some techniques some microphone techniques now i don't have the opportunity today to teach you the a different type of microphone techniques but i can teach you the sound techniques actually still i'll give you some tips for those who don't know actually see when you will record some promos or like you are listening to radio xyz this type of Thing, need to have a lot of bass actually okay uh, compressed type of punchy sound so in that time you may you know get close to the microphone technically it is called the proximity effect right now I'm talking to you I think uh, I am six inches away from my microphone around six inches away but if I have to record something some promo I'll close I'll get close to the microphone and I'll enjoy the proximity See now I'm now you know 
little busy. So yes, you are listening to Radio XYZ. I am your host Pradeep and blah blah blah. But when you are uh, we will record something normal like interview, like podcast and something like that, you should be at least six inches away from your microphone and you shouldn't process it so that it, 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 it has a lot of bass in it. Okay, because someone will listen it for at least 20, 15 to 20 minutes, sometime even one hour or maybe more than one hour. Okay, so again, one thing I have seen, like people are doing tutorials, they have increased their bass a lot. Now see, if I just, you know, come close to the microphone and increase the bass and talk to you, like, see, when you open Gold Wave, you need to press Control plus O and then you just press to sh press Shift Tab twice to get your folder tree. So if I just speak like this for one hour, you'll be bored. Okay, you'll, you'll be having air fatigue. Okay, so it, it's, it's very important to learn the proper microphone technique. And there are some angle techniques as well, which I don't have time to uh, demonstrate right now. So first thing what I'll try to do is maybe a promo. Let, let me try. I'll also give you my jaws. And I display as well okay so what to record you are listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep stay tuned you are listening to the Saturday night this is not the best I mean this is the worst voiceover I have recorded I'll undo that I'll try to record a little better because I was not prepared to do so anyway you are listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. You are listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Okay, so that is the recording, for example. So I, I have just, uh, you know, uh, gone close to the microphone so that I sound a little bassy. Now, first. What I'll do, I'll use noise gate because there are some unwanted sound, not so much, but still something is there. So let me go to the filter menu. And but unfortunately, we cannot hear your jaws sound. What? You cannot? Just let me see. Leaving menu. Yeah, sorry. Okay. Alt C menu. Effect menu, auto offset removal dot dot dot, no, noise reduction dot, noise gate dot dot, enter, leaving menus, file untitled one, noise gate dialog, presets edit, so I'll straight go to the parameter, Pre can hell, threshold left paren db right paren colon edit combo, minus 30.00, minus 30 is there, let's see how it performs. You are listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep, enjoy and stay tuned. Maybe I can increase it a little bit. Pa page up, minus 28 points. Page up. You are listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Okay, that's fine. I think I have kept it to minus threshold left paren db right paren colon edit combo minus twenty six points minus twenty six. Okay, the rest of the parameters are like default. Attack left paren s right paren colon edit combo zero point two zero z release left paren s. I have right. not touched anything. Just just this thing. Okay, so I'm pressing enter. Enter. Ten percent. 100%. File untitled one. File untitled one. You were listening. Now, there is a bit of silence uh, at the very beginning and at the very end. Okay. So, what can I do? I can just select those silent portions and delete it myself. Or, what I can do, I can use the silent reduction feature of Gold Web. Uh, so I'll press Alt Control S in my case. Silence reduction dialog. And I'll, see, I'll select a particular preset one second reduction which is one second reduction one second reduction what I have, what are the parameters which i have said before i'll just let you know preset preset preview stop okay cancel help attributes of silence to reduce silence threshold left paren db right paren colon edit combo minus 36.00 so minus 36 is the threshold i'll increase that page up minus th somebody's microphone is unmuted would you like to ask anything? Uh, otherwise, please mute your microphone. Page up. Minus 31.00. Page up. Minus 27.00. Page up. 
minus 26 points. So I have kept it to minus 26, the same value which I have provided in the previous noise kit. Attributes of silence to reduce duration left paren s right paren colon edit combo 1.00. So that is the one second. I mean, there should be only one seconds of silence. Reduction level reduced to left paren percent right paren colon edit combo 100. I'll reduce by 100%, so that's not a problem. Reduction level maximum length left paren s right paren colon edit combo 0 0.50. Uh, that's a uh, uh, maximum length after reduction. That's not a problem. Reduction level full cross fade checkbox checked. Cross fade will be checked. I mean, more, the rest of the parameters are like normal. Just one second and the threshold. These two are you know, the main parameters which you need to adjust most of the cases. Okay. So I'm pressing enter, enter. to apply 19%, the same. 100%. File on time seven. You were listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Fine. So next thing. Time 7.663. So what I'll do, I'll apply the equalizer. Okay. Equalizer dialog. Presets edit. Now I'm using. Okay, let me use the parametric equalizer because the last day I have used the graphical equalizer. State. Graphic File equalizer. So parametric let me EQ. Try the parametric one. Preview. Stop. Okay. Can help. Band edit combo. One. So that is the first band. Add band. Edit. Zero hours. Zero minutes. And zero seconds. Z gain left paren db right paren colon edit combo. 0, 0.00. That is the gain. Center left paren hertz right paren colon edit combo. 1000.0. And that is the frequency. Width left paren hertz right paren colon edit combo. 20.0. Then this is the width or the Q. Presets edit combo. These three options are very important actually. Width. Gain left paren db so right. So first, the gain. What I'll do, as unfortunately I don't have a good high pass filter i'll decrease the volume around 60 db or maybe 70 db because i don't need anything you know below 70 so at is a graphic equalizer I'll, I'll i'll do it like uh, you know 60 db i'll select 60 hertz and then decrease the gain maybe by 60 db or 8 db page down minus 1.0 page, page down minus 7.00 page down Minus 8.0. Maybe 8, 8 dB. So I'm turning down by 8 dB. Center left paren hertz right paren colon edit combo. 1000.0. So here it is set to 1000. I'll set it to 60. I'm just typing that. 60. Center left paren hertz right paren colon edit combo. 60. Okay. And. Width left paren hertz right paren colon edit combo. 20.0. Width is set to 20. I'll just decrease it a little bit. Page down. 21.20. Oh, that is the lowest option. Uh, okay, fine. Now I'll, I'll go with that. So that is the first band, first thing I have done. Okay, and let me see, let me hear how it sounds right now. I have just decreased the gain of the very low end around 60 hertz. You were listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. So you'll find a, not a lot of difference, a little bit of uh, you know mud cleaning, you can say. Now let me go to the next band. Center, gain left correct edit. Add band, band edit combo one. So here is only one band. By default, I'll add one. Add band. Band edit combo. Two. So I'm at band number two. Add band. Remove band. Edit. Zero hours. Now. Gain left paren db. Next thing what I'll do. I'll. I, I want a little more base. So maybe around 100 or 10 or so. Maybe 100. I'll try to increase a little bit. Center left paren hertz right paren colon edit combo. 1000 points. So center I'll type 100. 100 gain left paren db gain uh okay gain later center with left paren. width i'll increase a little bit page up 30.0 maybe 30 and then i'll increase the gain too much just to see how it sounds i mean I, I, whether i have selected the proper frequency Se okay. gain left paren db right paren colon edit combo zero it is set to zero page up 3.0 page up 9.0 9 db let's see how it sounds you were listening to the Saturday night with DJ Maybe. Pradeep. Page up. Enjoy. And you were listening to the Saturday night. Yeah, I think I have selected the right frequency. So obviously I'll not increase it too much. P page down. I'll 8. just. 0. Page down. Page down. 5.00. Let's see. What about 5.0 dB? You were listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. I think not, not bad. Okay, mm, maybe four, four, let's see. Page down, four point. You were listening to the Saturday night. Yes, that's the perfect one, four dB. So I have increased my gain around 100 hertz 
because uh, I, I, I wish to have a little base because it is a kind of promo type of thing. So that is why I have just increased it. If it is a normal voiceover or podcast or maybe a radio show or interview or something like that, I will not touch that because I am already sounding good. Uh, fortunately slash unfortunately, I am using a very good piece of microphone, which is a gold standard microphone in terms of voiceover and vocal. Okay, so it is already sounding pretty good. Okay, now let me go move to the next parameter, uh, next pre uh, frequency. I'll add one more band. Edit, remove band, add band. Now make sure that I am at band number three. Band edit combo three. Good. So next I'll clean up the boxiness. There is a little bit of boxiness. I told you in the uh, other day. Okay, so around 400 or maybe 350, maybe 380, I'm guessing. Now, see, I'm very easily telling you like, okay, around 380 because I am having a trendy ears. But what you can do, you just start looking at 400. And if you have a little bassy voice, then you can just go below that, maybe 380, 350. If you have little thin voice, then you can also go up like 420, 410, maybe 450 maximum. And you do it you know too much like uh, uh, you know uh, increase the gain too much just to see that okay i have selected the proper frequency or not add band remove band edit zero hours gain left right. gain for the time being i'm increasing it too much page up 10.00 10 db center left current hertz right. center i mean center frequency i'm typing 400 or maybe 380 380 with left current hertz right. with uh, maybe 25 23.0 24.25.0 now check. You were listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep. So bad sounding because I have increased the gain, which which I should decrease, and it is sounding now a more boxy. Center left paren hertz right gain left twelve point zero. Uh, zero what, uh, one one quick question here. Yes. Uh, when you say fit, that would when when four hundred is the is the is the central value that you've taken. Ah. Width twenty five would mean. Uh, it would be in 375 to 425. Is that what you mean? Kind of this. It's not the actual value. And I don't know how Goldwave count this. Okay. Uh, it's a kind of value in percentage. Okay. But the story is, if you increase the width, that means it will be increased like that way, the way you have described. Like if I make it 30, maybe it will be like 370 to 430, something like that. Okay. But okay. I don't know whether, no, I'm, I don't know means I'm sure that they are not, you know, design it that way like exactly 30 db plus and 30 db minus maybe this is now from maybe i am guessing by listening this maybe it's around 320 to uh maybe 480 or something like that okay uh which i have selected right now maybe i am guessing i don't know center left gain left so now i have even increased the gain by 12 db you were listening to the saturday night see uh, you are listening like like this like this sound has been increased okay now i'll obviously going to decrease page down 14.00 page down 7.0 page down 1.0 page down minus 2.0 page down minus 3.00 let let me see i have just decreased it by 3 db minus 3 center left you were listening to the saturday night with dj pradeep enjoy and stay tuned okay now fine now the next thing which you may try to do, which I'll not do because I'm as I'm using a very good piece of microphone, I'm already very bright. I'm uh, my mid range is fine, but you may try if you find that okay your words are not that clear, you can try around eighteen hundred to twenty. I mean two thousand hertz. Okay, try to increase and decrease and see if it sounds better. That is the mid range area of our voice for the female voiceover artist. Uh, that area will be uh, around uh, 3000 to 3200 or maybe sometimes uh, if it is a very thin type of voice maybe 3500 as well so try to look at that area because if you don't have proper microphone maybe your mid range is little bit like dull like this see now my mid range is a little bit dull because i have put my hand in front of my in front of my mouth okay now i am uh, fine <laughs> okay so but unfortunately i or fortunately i don't need to touch this I'll just add a little air in the high range. It is already very bright, but you know, just to give it a little modern touch, I'll add a little air uh, around maybe 10,000 or 11,000 hertz. So I'll add one more band. Game, edit, remove, add band. Make band sure that I'm um, four. band number four, right? Fine. 
now edit gain left center left parent one top gain left parent gain i'll just add away at 2 db so i'm typing two. 2 gain left parent db right parent colon edit combo 2 center left parent hertz right parent colon edit combo 1000.0 yeah i'm typing 11000 11000 with left parent hertz right and with i'll just go with 25 24 points 25 points and see you were listening to the saturday night with dj pradeep just Enjoy to let, and stay just to let you know i'll increase the gain too much so that you can hear how far i have increased it Set, gain left parent db right parent p p page up 11.0 you were listening to the saturday night with dj pradeep the s are now very prominent even i'll try to make uh, i'll try to go with 10000 hertz center left parent. i have selected 11000 i'll go 10000 because it is i think not the right frequency i mean right sound what i wanted to hear 10000 gain left parent i'm still with a heavy very high gain you were listening to the saturday night i think i'm fine just decreasing it page down 5 points page down 3 points page down 2 points so Set. only 2 db i have increased you were listening to the saturday night with dj pradeep enjoy and stay tuned yeah sounding good now with left parent, presets edit comp enter file on one thing i have stated earlier also earlier classes like i i ask you i i wish that you also listen the same episode when it will be posted on youtube you'll get much more better sound quality here in zoom uh it's not that great so now it is applied so let me just play the same with and without the equalizer now with the equalizer you were listening to the saturday night with dj pradeep let enjoy me, and stay tuned let me undo that undo and play you were listening to the saturday night with dj pradeep enjoy and stay tuned again applying the equalizer Time. you were listening to the saturday night with dj pradeep enjoy and stay tuned a very subtle difference but it makes the sound much more better and especially you'll feel it if you play it in a hi-fi system as well as a mobile system okay so that is something i have applied right now the equalizer so actually what is the difference between gain and uh, width width in the equalizer is how much area it will increase or decrease or select now the frequency which i'm giving like let's, let's say 4, 400 so it's not like only 400 hertz a single tone 400 hertz will be increased it's it means around 400 hertz now around means how much from 390 to 410 from 380 to 420 from 370 to 430 how much area it will select or it will process it depends on the width if you increase the width more area will be selected if you decrease the width less area will be selected okay fine and and gain 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 means i have selected a particular area using the center frequency and the width slider now i can either increase the gain or decrease the gain of that particular selected area suppose i have applied air sound then i increase the gain means uh, the air air sound i mean yes airiness and will be increased increase. right yeah now see if you don't like air if you want to decrease the air effect then you need to uh just you know decrease okay. just decrease the gain yes okay. fine the next thing which i'll apply is the compressor and i'll apply the same compressor the rough rider 3 which i used in the vocal processing Alt -C, G -W -V, ambient w t d r take delay rough rider 3 left enter leaving menus file on presets edit combo to set the value okay so this rough rider 3 is a very good compressor and the presets are also good so let me see what are the presets 01 dash nice start Zero nice one start is the nice best preset it is a really very really nice start 02 dash full metal full metal 03 dash just a bit off the 04 dash hysteresis 05 dash waffle stomper og dash 01 dash new york peril og dash 02 dash hard pump og dash 03 dash nuclear option og dash 04 dash good one og dash 05 dash heavy duty so these are the preset so by hearing the name let me try the hard pump og03 dash nuclear og02 dash hard pump let me see how it sounds you were listening to the saturday night no it is too much compressed og01 dash new york peril 
Zero so what I'll do, I'll just go with a nice start and see how, how it sounds. Zero four dash, zero, zero one dash, nice start. You are listening to The Saturday Night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Yeah, I'm liking that, but only I need to, I don't like that, that compressed. It is already compressed. I mean, sounding good because I have already, you know, used the proximity uh, kind of effect. So it is compre compressing a little more than I expected. So what I'll do, I'll just increase the threshold. Alt B, edit. So I have pressed Alt plus B to get the basic parameters. Preset, pre, 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 okay, help, SEHPF, left, input LVL, left paren, DV, right paren, colon, edit combo. Zero, sensitivity, left paren, DV, right paren, colon, edit combo. 0 0.635. So this is the sens sensitivity slider. Sensitivity slider. Okay. And I'll increase it a little bit so that it compresses less. 0 0.640. 0 0.660. 0 0.700. Let me see. You are listening to The Saturday Night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Good. Not bad. So I'll press the OK button. Yep. Cancel. OK. 9%. 100%. File untitled 1. Fine. Time. Now, you are listening to The Saturday Night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Okay, now just give it a little bit of character or, you know, uh, something like that. So, uh, I don't know what I'll do. If I select, uh, let's say the set. You were listening to the Saturday night. 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 With Saturday so I have selected the Saturday Saturday night. Saturday night. And I wish to sound it a little different than it is because it is the name of the program, for example. And how to do, do that? Saturday night. Uh, I can apply obviously some delay, but that is very basic. Let me see what is there. Alt, dot, echo, fill, flange, frequency, interpolate, invert. Frequency flanger dot dot. Let's see how the flanger works. Enter. I'm, I, I'm, I'm not sure whether it will work. Alien. Oh my Big god. Big and small. Saturday night. Chorus. Saturday, Saturday night. night. Chorus 2. Saturday night. Chorus 3. Saturday night. Saturday night. Saturday night. No. Escape. File on title 1. I'm not one. happy with that. So. Uh, what to do? Okay. So. Yeah, let me try to do. Now, Gold Wave allow you to process your channel independently. So, this is a stereo audio. Whatever we are doing so far, we are doing with both the channel, left and right. But I can select a particular channel and then I can work with it. Okay. So, what I'll do, I'll see if, if it, it makes any difference. I'll select the left channel or right channel and process it differently and see how it sounds. Okay. It's just like experiment. I, I'm not a regular gold wave user. Uh, in Reaper, I can do a lot of stuff. Now, let me go to the edit menu because I have forgot the hotkeys to select the channels. Okay. Redo, cut, 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 copy, paste, 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 mix, dot, cross, fit, override, replay, delete, dot, trim, sub, mute, shift, insert, side, blended, mark, find, dot, select, view, control, select, all, control, selection, sub, menu. Yes. Set dot dot previous shift move start move fin moves moves move fin move fin store select recalls snap set dot previous selection channel sub cube chan select channels dot 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 all shift plus control plus a okay okay all all is shift plus control plus a that means both channel left shift plus control plus l checked l left shift plus control plus l right shift plus control plus r checked r and right center unavailable now see here it is a little different okay right shift plus control plus r checked r Left shift plus control plus L checked. L. That means these bo these channels left and right are checked. Okay. So if I need to process only the right channel, I need to uncheck the left one. Right shift plus control plus R checked. R. Okay. I, uh, so that something it works this this way. Enter. Leaving menus. File untitled one. Now if I do anything. Saturday night. So you can see. You can just hear the left. Maybe those who are listening Zoom from mobile. They cannot from get Dinesh it. Kumar to everyone, colon. But uh, you know, uh, I am getting my voice only from my right. Uh, sorry, left channel. Saturday night. Okay. Audio so, now. excuse me, sir. Yes. Sir, uh, can you sir repeat what did you do? So, uh, did 
how did you cancel the channel from the left side yeah i, I have did, uh, i went to the edit menu and from the channel sub menu i have unchecked the right one that means my left one is now checked and i can hear only the left and if i do something with that that will only affect the you know left channel right now saturday oh, now saturday now okay, sure. yes so what i'll do na let let try something i i'll add uh, maybe 5 milliseconds of silence okay in such 5 milliseconds of silence and see how it works i don't know what it will do but let let me try so i'm pressing the control i key insert silence duration and duration left parent zero period one blank blank one blank and one i'm typing 0.5 five enter file untitled one duration 0.500 uh why it is like time eight you were listening to the saturday night I, i think it is too much so i'm undoing that undo saturday night i'll add two milliseconds of silence insert silence and zero 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 blank blank home zero period five zero five two enter file untitled one duration zero point two zero zero now i'll select uh, i'll again activate the right channel right channel selected sir 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 or maybe whole channel all channel selected control shift oh my Time. god you were listening to the saturday, saturday night. night okay <laughs> uh, you were listening to the saturday, saturday night. night with with dj, DJ pradeep. pradeep enjoy, enjoy and, and stay, stay tuned, tuned. Uh, i am almost there but not quite there okay there is there some you know Undo. problem with that saturday night hey, hey, just just a question here ha, ha, ha. Uh, i i am a little lost here when you said you going to add some silence So, yes. uh, so this uh, silence that you applied on the left channel, uh, what what exactly is the expectation from there when you applied uh, two milliseconds of uh, silence? Wow. Okay. So you expect but, it to be silent? Ah, huh, okay. Yeah, I what actually I wish or I am planning or I am trying to do is it it will be a double track thing. That means two two voices are coming from two ears. Okay, so Saturday night like two Pradeeps are speaking together. okay the effect which you used to get sometimes you know so it's it technically called double tracking or dt in short so i i, I actually wanted to have double tracking but uh, finish 7 saturday night with saturday night saturday night saturday night so i am selecting only this saturday night i am adding a uh, silence again insert silence home period 2 0 2 just one enter one file untitled one uh, you were listening all channels you were listening to the saturday, saturday night, night with, with dj radhi ah uh, now the problem is I, i don't know why it is happening like that so see no, no, i have sir sir excuse me sir yes i want to ask why why the audio of uh from from my right side is is kind of far but on my left side it's kind of near so so they are not uh, equal equal sound like like uh, on my left side it is uh, ne- uh, far then from the on my left side it is near so they are not you know what i mean sir they they are not equal now so, there might be so, several reasons observe, there might be several reasons for that first of all uh, you will check your sound balance in your volume mixer whether it is right or wrong okay or maybe you are having some issues with the headphone okay so it is hard to tell from my side what is happening over there without listening okay. the actual problem okay, okay, yeah there is another thing which i noticed was that uh, the left channel it starts off by saying you are listening and the right channel comes in a little later saying saturday night yes is yes, that, that how you uh, yes that's yes. how you meant it yeah okay now see what happened right now you were listening to the you are listening to the i am getting from my center okay while i am wearing my uh, listening through my headphone now from the saturday night life and rest i am getting two voices one voice is coming from my left ears one is coming from the right ear okay so i am getting actually two voices till the end how i have achieved this 
आई हैव जस्ट एडेड वन मिली सेकेंड ऑफ डिले और साइलेंस इन माई लेफ्ट चैनल सो वाट इज हैपनिंग द राइट चैनल इज कमिंग फास्ट एंड देन द लेफ्ट चैनल इन वन मिली सेकेंड बट ना द प्रॉब्लम इज आई ओनली विश टू हैव सैटरडे नाइट शुड बी दू नो फ्रॉम द बोथ ईयर्स आई मीन द डी टी इफेक्ट डबल ट्रैपिंग ट्रैकिंग इफेक्ट नाउ वाट हैपन टिल नाउ वाट आई हैव फाउंड दैट स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम सैटरडे नाइट टिल द एंड आई एम गेटिंग डी टी डबल ट्रैकिंग सी यू आर लिसनिंग टू द सैटरडे नाइट with dj radhi so all are coming like you know uh, uh, like chorus type of thing if you are listening in mono but if you are listening in stereo you'll get like two voices from two speakers okay now to fix that what i'll do i'll select the rest of the audio after saturday night okay you were listening to the saturday, saturday night with, with dj so i have selected from with dj pradeep and the rest and now again i'll Uh, only process the right and left channel right channel selected uh with dj pradeep yes. so i'm i'm getting my left channel right now so i'll cut down exactly 1 millisecond it's very tough to do you know selecting 1 millisecond now still i'll set try selection. to do time based range radio button check now i'm going to the set selection dialog by shift plus e because here i'll have to exactly select 1 millisecond now see my start time is start colon edit Zero hours, zero minutes, and two seconds. Ninety thousand. That means Probe, zero colon zero zero colon zero two period nine zero 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 blank nine zero 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 zero. Okay, that is my start time. And what is the end time? Combo box. Finish colon. Edit. Zero hours, zero minutes, and seven seconds. Seventy six thousand. That is the very end. What I'll do? Com start colon edit. Zero hours, zero minutes, and two seconds. Nine. I'll copy this. Copied. and paste the same in the finish combo edit 0 hours pasted re edit 0 hours 0 minutes and 2 seconds 90000 so now i have selected actually nothing my start marker and finish marker is there in the same position what i'll do i'll just increase it in the finish marker see the finish Boom. marker is now 0 0 colon 0 0 colon 0 2 period 9 90000 nine, so i'll just change it to If I add one more second, that means I'll have to period two zero two increase this two period. seconds to three two and three zero 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 nine zero. I'll make the nine to zero nine. So that means zero. edit zero hours zero minutes and three seconds zero 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 zero. So it was like two seconds and nine hundred milliseconds or nine thousand milliseconds, and I have changed the finish marker to three seconds. If I press enter enter. And if I check the duration, duration zero point one zero zero. So it is C zero point one zero zero. So I hope I have exactly selected one millisecond. Now I'll delete this because previously I have added one millisecond. And now I'm deleting this. No sound selected. Okay. Now right if I select the whole audio, time seven point seven. You were listening to the Saturday, Saturday night, night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Yes. I have achieved my goal. So what is happening? Those who are not listening in stereo, you are listening to is coming from the center. Saturday night is coming from both ears. It's like two Pradeeps. Two Pradeeps are talking together. Yes. Hello. Yes. Hello. Uh, good afternoon. Yeah. Good afternoon. From from this end, I believe it's evening over. How do you? Apply that double feedback. Sorry? I know you use insert I, but I didn't. I didn't really get the application of that double voice feedback. Uh huh. So your question is how I have applied or why I have applied. I didn't get your. Yes. Does how did you apply double feedback? Like okay, yeah. I'm not seeing your name. Okay. okay. No problem. No problem. So see what I did because I am having a stereo file. This is recorded in stereo. Okay, though it is coming from the center, stereo doesn't means that okay. it will come like spread it and all over your ears, all over over your sound space. It is coming from the center. So just to make it like double tracking, like maybe two people are talking together in a chorus type of thing. What I did first, I have selected a portion of the audio which I want DT, a uh, double tracking. Uh, so I have selected the Saturday night. 
and then I have selected only the left channel. Okay. okay. And then what I did, I have added one milliseconds of extra silence in this track. That means it will go after this. It will go one second after the actual audio. That means there will be a difference between my left and right channel. Both are not talking together. It's talking after one milliseconds. Okay. So what I, what I achieved after adding one millisecond, I have achieved like after Saturday night till the end, I am getting double tracking, which I actually didn't want. I want only the Saturday night to be double tracked. So what I did, I have selected the audio after Saturday night. And again, I have selected only the left channel and deleted one millisecond from there. Because previously I have added one millisecond of silence. And after that, I have deleted one millisecond of silence so that the rest of the audio comes in the center. So what the my final achievement is, like you are listening to is coming from the center. Then Saturday night is coming from both my ears. And then the rest are again coming from the center. Okay. So that is something which I have achieved. Yeah, there's one more thing. Can you hear me? Yes. Yeah, one more thing, which is that uh, when you uh, applied this uh, this application, there seems to be a reverb also. Is that uh, is that also part of the whole thing? No, I have not applied the reverb right now. Yeah, but this recording now, when uh, when you were playing it, uh, apart, along with the double effect, uh -huh. also seems to be a uh, there also seems to be a reverb. No, that is that is because of the zoom because zoom can maybe only processing the mono track, so that is why you may get some reverb type of thing. But actually, I have not applied any reverb. Uh, if you listen it in headphone later on in your, while you are browsing in YouTube, you'll find that yeah. there are two voices coming from both speakers. It's like two buddies are talking together Saturday night. Right. Right. Okay. Fine. Now, you are listening to the Saturday, Saturday night, night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay, stay tuned. So, I'm, I'm trying to do something with the stay tuned. If you please mute your microphone, please. Stay tuned. Stay 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 tuned. Stay tuned. So I have selected stay tuned. I want something like slow down effect. Okay, please. I want to know if this uh, class is being recorded because I can't see the icon here. Yeah, this this class is recorded. Okay, not from Zoom itself, but using some third party resources. Alt C menu. Compress Doppler dot dot dot. So I want to have some doubler effect. Enter. Leaving menu. There are some good presets. Default. Faster. Slow down. Slow down is one of the presets. Stay tuned. Yes. Enter. File untitled one. 41%. 100%. Just to, you know. Stay tuned. And here I can just, this area, I can just add a little bit of delay. Equalizer dialog. Preset ah, escape. That's File on key. Echo dialog. Pre okay. Can help. Echoes colon edit combo. One. So number of echoes, I'll add two echoes. Two. And I'll check the stereo checkbox. D feedback left, stereo checkbox. No Checked. And Feed volume left, paren DB. I'll decrease the volume. Page down, minus 10.00. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Okay. Uh, I'll decrease the delay left, paren S right, delay paren colon time. combo. 0 0.40. Z Stay, Stay tuned. tuned. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. 0 0.1000. Stay tuned. Just this much. Stay tuned. Only there is a t -t sound tuned. That is something I'm not liking. Maybe I'll try to do something with that later on. Okay. So for the time being, enter. I'm 26%. Enter. 100%. So what is the result till now? Time nine. You were listening to the Saturday, Saturday night, night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay, stay tuned. tuned. And let me do something with the tuned. Stop. There is some extra audio, I believe, at the very end. Time now. You were listening to the Saturday, Saturday night, night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay, stay tuned. tuned. Duration 1.441. Deleted. There was some extra audio, I mean, silence idea at the end. I have deleted. So t this t stay tuned. I mean, this D tuned. I have sp I have not like spoken like tuned. I have I have not done like that. But as the pitch has been down right now, so it is sounding like terrific. So how can I 
I cannot delete that because it will sound bad. So what I'll do, I'll add fade out so that it fade outs properly. Fade out dialog. Presets and I'll select a uh, logarithmic. Make. 0 dB to minus 12 dB. Logarithmic. Now, linear fade out. I mean fade out which will do very fast. Default. Full volume to 50%. Full volume to silence. Linear. Enter. 100%. File on type. Full volume to silence linear. I have applied that. Let me see. Now what I need to do, I need to add from there. Undo. So I'm undoing this. Here I need to apply the fade out. Fade out dial. Full volume to silence. Linear. Enter. File on. And I'll also decrease the volume of this area. Change volume. By 6 volume. dB or 8 dB. Page down. Minus 5 point. Page down. Minus 9.00. Enter. 100. Now see. Time. If I play this. You are listening to the Saturday, Saturday night, night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Yeah, it is under balance. Not bad. You were listening to the... Okay. Now, what I can do... I can just add a little touch of the reverb. Not that much. Because it is a promo. So, I can certainly add a little bit of reverb. So, I am applying. I am going there. Alt C. Menu. G W. And I am applying the... Ambient reverb. Ambient bracket. reverb. Enter. Leaving menus. You were listening to the... Not this much. Oh my god. Alt B. Edit. Pre... Pre... Oh, can help input level left paren D output level left dry level left paren DB right ER level left paren DB right paren colon edit combo 0 0.955 so ER level or early reflection I'll turn it down 0 0.920 0 0.910 0 0.900 late level left late level I'll turn it down page down 0 0.900 page down 0 0.800 you were listening to the Saturday, Saturday night, night with DJ Pradeep you were listening to the Saturday, Saturday night, night with DJ Pradeep. Predele left left paren MS right paren colon edit combo. Zero point predele right left decay time left paren sec right paren colon edit combo. 0 0.392. I'll increase a little bit of decay Zero. timing. 0 0.450. 0 0.44. You were listening to the Saturday night, night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Again, this has some reverb in it. But I have applied that because I know that I'll add some music with that. So that is why I have only applied this. Otherwise, I, I, I didn't do that. Okay. Decay freeze colon edit. Size left paren percent. Wide left. Rest of the things are fine. So I'll just press EQ the OK load, button. EQ, EQ, okay. File untitled one. Nine percent. One hundred percent. File untitled one. So now the audio is like this. You were listening to the Saturday, Saturday night, night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Now I need to find a proper BGM. Open sound. I don't Ex know. And voice over test. Uh, and name 4.mp3. Is that great? Let's see. Alt B. Preview selected file. Alt. And name. Tree view. Command. Tree view. Tree. One. One drive club. This. Shell fold. Solder song. Paint. Up. NBK. Guitar roman. Gat. Birthday voice over. Gatch lag. Earth. Escape. Untitled. No. Just let me find something. Windows really 8. quickly. Project left. Enter. Best sample. BG Muse. Enter. And. And, and name enter. Volume set to BG and name to enter. Unmanned one dot M enter. Maybe this one. Copy will work. Alt F4 one. Bikram Gold Wave. File untitled one. So I'll open this in Gold Wave. Open sound. Exp not selected. Pasted. Shell folder view. Exp enter. One percent. Gold Wave. File untitled one. Time fifty three. Now I'll select and copy my voiceover. File untitled one. Time set. Copied. You were listening to the. You were. So there is still a, si a little bit of silence at the very beginning. I'll delete that. You were. Times. You were. You were. Times seven point two eight zero. You were listening to. Yes, fine. Now I'll copy this. Copied. File. Mixed dialogue. Uh, this is not the right voice uh, BGM for this, but still just for testing. You were listening to the. Uh. Now see, this is a promo, so I, this is not like uh, first the voiceover. I mean, the BGM will start and then the BGM will fade out and then the voiceover will come. It's not like that because it is a promo and it's a very short one. Okay, so uh, it will start together. You were listening to the Saturday with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. 
something like that so what i'll need to do i need to turn down the gain volume of my escape. bgm track now from the mixing dialog i have press escape to cancel that mix dialog because from the mixing dialog i can only change the volume of my voiceover i cannot change the volume of the bgm so first i'll need to change the volume of the bgm manually change volume dialog Vol page down Volume left current dB right current colon edit combo minus six point zero zero and zero percent. So six dB volume I have decreased. File on mand one dot mp three. Okay, now go to the mix dialog. There is also a bit of silence. I delete that. Please, hello, excuse me, sir. Yes, yes. Yes, please. Uh, like this sound you just imported into this uh, demo. So I don't really get how you're able to blend them together before even reducing the audio and the uh, I mean volume. But I want to know how you, is, you, is it that you just copied and pasted or I didn't really get, I didn't really get the blending. Okay, the first thing is uh, now see my two files are open right now. One is the my voiceover, File on title. you were listening and one is the BGM. File on okay. Time. Okay. And uh, I want to blend together, so I'll I am copying the voiceover. File untitled one time seven point two eight zero. I'm selecting the voiceover and copying it. Copied. Now I'll go to the mix. I mean the BGM file. And there I'll not paste it. I'll mix it, and I'll press Control plus M to go to the mix dialog. I'll again show you. Okay. First I need to. There is a little bit of silence in the beginning of this BGM. So that is something I need to remove. No sound selected. Time. Fit. Yeah. Now I'll go to the mix dialog. Mix dialog. Time where mix will begin. Colon. Time. First is the time where you can just you know adjust the time. Uh, fine tune your where, where the you know voiceover or the clipboard audio should should start. Now it is starting from the very very beginning. See, like if I preview it, you were listening to the Saturday Night with DJ Pradeep. Okay, which I want, fortunately. So there is no problem. But if I ha if I wish, like, okay, first the music will start for one second, it will go for one second, and then my voice will go on. Then I can just adjust it from there. Or I, what I could do, I could put the start marker in the BGM where my voiceover should start, and then press Control plus M to go to the mixing dialog. There are some other options like preview, preview stop. stop, volume, okay, volume left parenthesis. Volume. This volume will control the volume of the clipboard audio, which is my voiceover. Okay, it will not control the volume of the BGM. Okay. So okay, let me press the OK button. File on mand one dot mp three. So now it sounds like this. You were listening to the Saturday Night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Uh, I wish uh, I would uh, decrease the volume of the BGM a little bit more. Undo. So I'm undoing this and uh, I'm decreasing the volume of this BGM again. Change vol volume. Maybe more. Pa page. Enter. Zero percent. Yeah. Time 53 point. Now I'll go to the mix dialog. Mix dialog. And the preview a little bit. You were listening to the. Enter. Yes, I'm 18. happy. Pressing enter. So you were listening to the. Now the whole VGM is there. VGM is way longer than this voiceover. Okay. Time 50. I'll have to delete this, obviously. You were listening to the Saturday Night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. This here I'll delete. Delete it. No sound. Time 7. You were listening to the Saturday Night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Fine. There is a snare tuck at the very end which I want to delete. So I have selected no that so and deleted. Time 7.068. You were listening to the Saturday Night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Ah, still a little bit of. Five. Zoom. No sound select. Fine. Now see the 
time 7.020. You are listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Fine. Now, when we'll do the professional voiceover thing, na, sometimes you will be given time. Within this time, you'll have to finish. Now, what is the duration of my voiceover right now? Time 7.020. 7.020 it. seconds. Right? But my producer asked me to complete it within 6 seconds. Now, what I'll have to do? I can just match the time. So, what I'll do, I'll go to the effects dialog. Alt C, resample dot, playback rate, volume submenu. You. Voice op, time dot 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 shift plus control plus F10. T. I'll go to the time dialog. Enter. Leaving menus. File unmanned one dot MP3. Time dialog. Presets edit combo. And here are some preset. I'll not go to the preset. I'll just press preview. Tab. Stop. Okay. Can help. Specify new relative change or length change. Left paren percent right paren colon radio button checked. Two or two. So here are two radio buttons. First one is percentage. So for example, your normal audio is 100%. If you want to make it 90%. You can type 90 and uh, it will decrease the audio according to that percentage. Or there is one more radio button. Specify new relative change or length, length, left paren, s, right paren, colon, radio button check. Yeah. So first one is percentage and second one is length. So I have selected the length one radio button and if I press tab. Specify new relative change or length edit 7.0195. So that is the current length of my file. 0 0.7195 something like that. So I'll make it 0 0.6. So I'll type Hold, that. Period. Seven. Period. Seven. I'll de delete. And seven. Type six. Six. Period. Zero. One. Nine. Five. Blank. Zero. One. Nine. Five. So I'll delete that. Five. Nine. One. Zero. I'll type zero. 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 Specify new relative change or length edit. Six point zero 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 zero. So I have typed exactly six seconds. Algorithm rate tab. So this is the algorithm tab. Presets edit combo. Algorithm rate tab. Algorithm similarity tab. Presets edit combo. So unfortunately, uh, I think there are some more options which are not accessible with uh, my screen reader. Just a piece. Preset. Okay. 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 Pre processing is fast. Changes the sampling rate. Rate tab. Similarity tab. FFT tab. Algorithm group. 1020. Bullet length left paren s right paren colon radio 1020. Algorithm group. Rate tab. Similarity tab. Changes the sampling rate. Pitch is changed. Gives best quality. Processing is fast. Presets group. Pro changes the sampling rate. Pitch is changed. Gives best quality. So uh, there are some algorithms which are not accessible using the normal cursor, but you can use your JAWS cursor or NVIDIA object navigation. But what I find now, PC. the normal, I mean, the default one works pretty good. Let me see. Let me check. Preview. And I'm not making a huge changes. Okay. I have a reminder for product. Uh, I'm not doing a huge changes. Just, uh, you know, turning down by one point some seconds. So let me press the OK button. Presets added. Preview. Stop. OK. File unmanned one dot MP3. Time 6.000. Selected. Now, exactly 6 seconds. And if I play. You are listening to the Saturday Night with DJ. Oh Daddy. my god. Enjoy and stay tuned. Enjoy. <laughs> something weird happened. Let me, let me, let me undo that and try. Undo. Maybe I have done something wrong. Alt, playback. I was in the wrong. Volume file. sub menu. Voice of time dot enter. First, Leader. I'll select. 150% similarity. 150% similarity. So it select the proper algorithm. I think there is some issues with the algorithm. You were listening to the Saturday night. <laughs> Obviously, it is too too fast. I'll not go with that. But I have selected this preset to start with. Now I'll press tab. Pre 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 stop. Okay. Cancel. Help. Specify new relative change or length change. Left paren percent right paren colon radio button check. Yeah, the percent is selected. I'll change it to length. Specify new relative. And then type. Specify new relative change or home. Period. Four. Blank. Six. Six. Period. Six. Seven. Nine. Seven. Blank. Seven nine seven six zero zero. Specify new relative change or length. You were listening to the Saturday night. night. Yes, now it is fine. Specify help cancel. Okay. I'm pressing OK button. File. So the story is you need to select one preset just to select the proper algorithm which you want, and then you can just modify yourself. Now see my audio is time five point nine 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 five point nine nine nine. I mean just six seconds, just one milliseconds away. That's not a big deal. Okay. And now, well, how, how it sounds like? You are listening to The Saturday Night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Okay, so that is something. But the uh, audio is quite faster, right? Yeah, you'll have to, because, because uh, so, if I am a professional voiceover artist, and if I have been assigned the task to do that, I may write a different script, or the script which uh, will be provided me 
should be within that particular seconds there might be one second two second difference now see it is already a very small voiceover okay so it had had to adjust a lot to make it uh, six seconds like for example in a radio or, or tv promo you have been given 30 seconds of time okay and then sc the script will be like this which you can you know uh, you know do within 30 seconds perform within 30 seconds but not sometimes you know it may be 31 seconds or so so in that case you can easily make like 30 seconds see for example if i open one more open voice. voice over test with tlm1 uh, and name 4.mp3 8 of 9 voice over this enter. one gold wave file voice the thing which i have played time one o'clock 943 select so this one minute time one o'clock 943 something seconds okay so if i make it try to make it one minute only let me see if i can do that Alt, volume sub menu voice over time dot enter leaving menu first i'll select a preset 150 percent similarity 150 yeah similarity pre stop okay cancel help specify specify new relative change or length length left paren s right paren length i have selected specify home four zero four zero period six two eight nine blank home four zero period six two eight nine blank is six to eight nine nine eight two six i'll delete and make it zero 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 Manushet Jibon, Bong Moy. Uh, sorry, I need to make it one minute. That means 60 seconds. Sorry. Specify Nurel Home. Four. Zero. Four. Six. Algorithm similarity test. Man. Enter. Zero percent. One hundred percent. File vote. Time 59.995. Selected. So now my time is 59.995. Previously it was one minute something seconds. Okay. Now listen it. Manushet Jibon Bornomoy. A Bornomoy Jibone Amon Onik Kotonai Kote. Now I'm undoing this just to undo. let you hear what it was previously. Time. Manushet Jibon Bornomoy. Okay, so it's almost sounding same, but I am within one minute. Because it is a long audio, so it, it, it doesn't get any like odd effect or too, too uh, fast. Okay. But at in, in my other example, my voiceover like was only seven point something seconds. So it's already very small one, and I have already spoken in a very in a fast manner. Like you are listening to, you are listening to. Uh, if I said like you are listening to, then you will get no problem with that. Okay, so that is something in you know you will have to do sometimes. You have to you know do within some seconds. It will be specified by your producer. Close file on man. Okay. So that is something you were listening to the Saturday night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. So this type of thing you can do and for the normal voiceover like normal podcast first thing is if you using you are using a dynamic microphone you can make at least three inches distance and the easy method to you know measure this if you keep your hand like a uh, what what should I say? Uh, the 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 position like pronoun if in in our in our culture, okay. And instead of uh, keeping your hand on your forehead, if you keep it on your mouth, one hand only. You don't need to put two hands together. If you just put one hand. There should be five fingers distance. If you put five fingers together, so what is the size of it? Without without any gaps. Without any gaps yes and that should be the distance if you you are using any dynamic microphone for the condenser you need to be little away from this okay uh if you are you, you recording like you know normal tutorial podcast and if you want to take class just the way i'm doing right now i'm at least six inches away from my microphone okay but if i use a dynamic i'll get a little closer like this so my voice will be uh from this distance but as the condenser is very sensitive i'm not coming very busy or like very focused which is not recommended actually so if you will apply that uh, if 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 not required don't put any reverb okay and uh, it will sound pro don't put extra bass put normal make sure your words are getting properly so if you find that your words are not identified properly you can increase the mid gain a little bit using equalizer 
okay and in some special cases like this the thing which i have demonstrated you can add some funny effects okay like slow down chorus even delay sometimes but that is especially for the promo maybe in the in between your podcast you have different segments okay so you may like tips and tricks so that that is might be one on se segments of your whole podcast so in that promo you can add like funny thing you know the boutique stuff but other than that you should be normal okay and i have not uh, checked the loudness which i must do time five point uh just go there alt f5 amplitude list view P peak amplitude colon minus 2.341 db minus peak amplitude dc offset possibly clip loudness colon minus 19.13 lufs minus 19.48 lufs five of seven so i'll uh obviously Escape. go File on man to the loudness dialog alt l 12 percent 100 percent Loudness dialog and make Preview. it minus 16 db LF. Okay. Volume left paren lufs right paren colon edit combo. Minus 23.00. Page up. Minus 19.00. Page up. Minus 16.00. Uh, this is the default loudness. Minus 23.00 because yes, in yes. my case I also seen ah, minus 23. Loudness Every that. audio. No, no, no. Not, it is not the uh, loudness of your audio. It's the loudness which is given in this loudness meter. Okay, if you okay, want okay. to know your loudness that is you can do you know from if you press shift plus tab from the preset dialog i mean preset box you'll get your loudness okay minus 16.33 loves okay now i'll press enter to apply this clipping control allow clipping radio i have allowed clipping for now enter 12 percent 100 percent file on mand one dot mp3 so obviously my some, some parts of my audio is over zero db that means i'm clipping so that is why i'll apply the limiter Alt C G W V M W one that W one limiter. Enter. Leaving menus. File on menu. And I'll just go with the default preset. Tab. Double stop. Okay. File on man one dot mp3. Error dialog. An exception occurred during processing. Okay. Oh my god. Gold wave. Okay. Button. So what happened now? My W one is crashed. And it happened in the last time as well. Now what will happen now if I press the OK button? Finally, though, fortunately, we have ended the class. I mean, we are at the very end of the class, so there's no problem. But when I'll press the OK button, gold wave will go away. So all of my recording and everything will gone because I have not even saved this. So please be careful. Please save your original audio. Even please save multiple copies of, of your audio. For example, let's say I have recorded the voice. So first I'll save it as voice.wav. Then I have applied the compressor. So I'll save it as voice with comp.wav. So my voice.wav is there because that is the raw sound. And then I'll add equalizer. So I'll save it as voice with equalizer and comp.wav. It will take much space. I know it will take a storage space of your hard drive. But later on, you can just safely delete this. Because if problems like this, see, I have made this voiceover for, for a long time. I, it took a lot of time. Now, when I'll press OK, it will go on. File on mand one mp3. File on gold wave. File on mand one oh. men menu. System escape, escape. You were listening to. Oh, I'm so fortunate. I'm so fortunate. It has not, uh, you know, destroyed my gold wave. Previously, it did. Now, let me check whether it has done anything, even after ex exception. So, I'm going to the Maximus dialog. 12%, 100%. Max list view. Left one zero point seven nine three two minus two point zero one dB zero hours zero minutes and three seconds twenty thousand two hundred forty one of two. Right two zero point seven 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 three minus two point one nine dB zero hours zero. Oh, Escape. I'm so Five lucky! I didn't clip. <laughs> Even I was minus two dB, which is very good. You were listening to the Saturday night, night with DJ Pradeep. Enjoy and stay tuned. Time five point nine nine nine. You have applied the laughs or loudness after the mix, right? Yes, yes. When everything will be so, done, I'm about to save my final audio, then I'll apply the loudness. Okay. And what about audio stories like multi voices, multiple now, uh, if voices you get from multiple, multiple voices? Yeah. What you can do first, you can process individual voice and then you can uh, use the loudness meter. But in the individual too, in, voice means yes. every voice I applied noise reduction if needed, then apply noise the gate, loudness, then, then apply equalizer, the loudness. then compressor, everything. Yeah, then apply the loudness. 
or what you can do like see because your problem is like people are sending maybe somebody is using uh, i mean recording from his own room where is this only fan noise somebody is recording maybe it's noise of the air conditioner so you you have to ultimately process it individually because you are getting voice from the normal environment not from the studio so ultimately you have to if you want good quality audio you have to adjust it now they are using different gain settings yes, because using someone mobile. have the uh, low quality microphone someone record ah. with mobile microphone ah. so what you can do That's... more you can just first you can um, like uh, remove the noise from those audios then you can just apply the loudness and that loudness should not be minus 18 or minus 16 because you'll have to process a lot you'll have to make it like minus 20 so every audio will be like minus 20 db lufs and then you can just put it together add together so it's a complete drama for example so everything is done i mean all audios are now in same volume and th those audios are noise free right now then you can use you know compressor and uh, maybe reverb if you want to, uh, to apply in the whole I mean, audio. after joining the uh, yes yes after audios. joining the and then when you're as done per our, as uh, per my yes, convenience yes and then if you add uh, want to add bgm add this so when you are done completely now you are going to save your final copy of your audio then you apply the loudness and make it minus 16 minus 15 or whatever you want okay at the very end okay then after applying the loudness it is necessary to apply the noise uh, sorry normalizer now it's not necessary to apply the normalizer but you will check whether you are crossing 0 db if you are crossing 0 db after applying the loudness you need to add some kind of limiter so that it doesn't cross 0 db anywhere you don't need to use the normalizer okay, so if if i don't uh, have the option to use limiter then, uh, then i can use unfortunately you have to normalize it and after normalizing you may get even low quality i mean low volume audio depending on the recording okay because you okay. know how normalizer works okay maybe the whole audio is like minus 10 db but one is minus 4 db so if you normalize it will be it will increase by only 4 db okay okay uh i just want to ask you a few questions can i uh, yes, can i yes. ask you a few questions yes yes uh number uh, number one is this um, the the you talked about w1 which is the limiter there is another one you talked about rough rider 3 rough rider 3 is the uh, is the compressor. compressor right yes yeah okay now uh, now when you use the equalizer or we talk to talk about the parametric uh, this one um, when you're doing a spoken language which is a, a conversation or a podcast or something uh, suppose we look at four bands which is 60 150 uh, 400 uh, in, uh, 1000 to maybe 5000 and then 10000 and above uh, 10000 and above you said is the air uh, the air effect yes. uh, and if it is the then the next level is uh, around 2000 if it is men and if it is women it's maybe about 3000 that you work around so uh, the the width we can we can keep about 25 or 30 on an average isn't it yes and in the lower band 60 for example uh, in a conversation thing uh, windows f5 what is what is it that you recommend uh, in a in spoken con conversation the 60 band will it be down. will the gain be down. you'll put it down you'll send it down by say 10 10 uh, minus yeah, 10 b minus 10 or so uh, if you can get an equalizer where there is a high pass and low pass i'll search for a free one and maybe we'll, uh, share you the link okay uh, maybe discuss in the group or email okay uh, so that if you find any equalizer which has proper high pass filter so you can apply a high pass filter around 80 or 90 hertz okay okay in, in case of conversation so that will remove okay. even 100 hertz you can apply okay that will remove the low end noise and unwanted low boofy sound from your audio okay uh, the other question i have is that uh, uh, can i request you to send me the uh, meaning uh, by email the link to the youtube channel so that uh, one can revisit yeah. the channels yeah i, I think I that's very important yeah. to revisit now, so i'm not on the i'm not on the youtube group so uh -huh. sorry i'm not on the whatsapp, WhatsApp group yeah so what yeah. i'll do after uploading this uh, last session 
I'll send you one email with the playlist link. I'll send everyone and I'll also send the same in the WhatsApp group, the playlist link of this particular okay. workshop. And I'll send you a Google Drive link of the plugins which I have mentioned in this uh, Gold Web course. And I'll ask you to please download the plugins within seven to ten days because after that I'll delete that. I don't have much space in Google Drive. Okay. No plugin is what the plugins are these uh... third party VSTs like ambient reverb, the W1 limiter. Because somebody okay, asked okay. me to send the same because he's not getting that in internet. So, so all I... we need to do is download it and uh, uh, apply it, right? Yes. Uh, execute it. Ah. Okay. Uh, and the last question I have, or it's a request is why don't you consider uh, doing a short uh, series of workshops of maybe two or three episodes where you actually uh, uh, do a session, do sessions on uh, voiceover, meaning how to use your voice uh, and, and, you know, the little micro, microphone, te microphone techniques and so on. So people who are interested can, uh, any, how, how many sessions do you think you'll need for this kind of a thing? Two, one, two, or maybe five, ten? Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I that's a very good idea. Actually, I, I'm, I'm liking that. That will take like a four to five session, I believe. Okay, but there is one catch actually. That is, you know, in that case, will better to leave Zoom and use some other platform which will provide better quality audio, like Team Talk or something like that. Team so, is the Microsoft Team. Microsoft Team. No, 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 no. Team Talk. Team Talk is a separate okay. application which was there for years, for uh, I think 15, 20 years. And you can specify the quality of the audio when you are joining and it can also provide stereo audio because, you know, this type of microphone positioning, voiceover, and uh, even when I do not repair classes, I use Team Talk because it provides the actual audio, uh, the stereo right. quality audio. So in Zoom, if I, you know, like to share like microphone position, see, I'm like out of face and now i'm in face it's, it's not a huge difference which you are getting from your end okay because yeah. it is zoom so that is a kind of challenge now team talk is itself accessible with jaws nvda even without any script there is script and add-on both for team talk i'll think for it and i'll let you know if you people can you know arrange team talk uh, if you people can join team oh, talk yeah. yes then, sir uh, i am using team talk and super uh, super <laughs> effective for uh, for tutorials and classroom yes. set so yes, that yes. is 100 percent so, legit sir so this is what this is a this is a, a what do you call it? is it the software or is it a platform like zoom or uh, what yeah, is a, it it is the software and it has some uh, free uh, uh, they call it like channel where you can i mean free platform or yes, I, I think i think tim talk is free for uh, unlimited time Client. Yes, yes. Yeah, I can even go for the Because, because Pradeep, yeah. you have uh, remembered, we have made some classes from yes, yes, with yes, Team yes, Talk yes. a few years ago uh -huh, uh -huh. in Bengali, Deepak. Yes. So, yes. so, so this uh, Team Talk, uh, Team Talk is uh, something that you download from the uh, from the ah. internet, or you have to buy it from somewhere. No, 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 no. You just download it from internet. You need to create a free account. Okay. Yeah. And just one thing to remember: while you are installing Team Talk, uh, it will ask like which version of Team Talk you want to install. And there are four versions. One, one is Team Talk. Second is Team Talk with server. Third one is Team Talk Classic, and uh, fourth one is Team Talk Classic with server. So you just install the Team Talk Classic one, which is very accessible. Okay. The third and, one. Yeah, yeah, third one. Or maybe I don't, okay. I don't know the actual direction of it, but Team Talk Classic oh, client or uh, only Team yes, Talk Classic. Yes, exactly. Team Talk Five Classic. Yeah. Uh, Team Talk 5 that Classic. is the that is the best uh, version of Team Talk that you need to install. Yes. So T E A M T A L K. Yes. One word. Ha, and the website okay. is bearware.dk. If you just search download Team Talk, the first website website should be bearware.dk. Okay, and from there you okay. can just download. And there is a JAWS script and Team Talk add-on made by Ducks Lee. So if you search like Team Talk add-on for NVDA or Team Talk JAWS script, which will give you some more feature, but even without script, you can use it. Okay, so please do consider this seriously because I think there will be a lot of takers. Okay, okay, I'll... I'll, 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 I'll and, and if you think uh, you need to charge something, uh, feel free to put that across. Uh, everybody, a reasonable amount, I think everybody would be willing to pay. Those who are serious will be willing to pay. Yes. yes so yes. think 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 about it and let me. And, uh -huh. and uh, I would be. I personally would be interested. Yeah. Okay. Okay. okay fine.
Okay, so, sir, thank you so much, sir. Thank you so yeah, much for the yeah. wonderful uh, journey that we had. Thank you very much. I have enjoyed it. I thought to talk I really to enjoy it. And, and thank you to yes, sir. Yes, sir. No problem, sir. You can yeah. talk to us. Yeah, the other question, the last question. The last question I have for you. Uh, the last question I have for you is, would you mind if we kind of called you when we have a have have few doubts when we are working no, on no, no problem, no problem, no problem. Okay, all right, okay. And what's a good time to call you? That's the next question. Uh, not any time specific. You can call me if I don't pick up your phone. I'll surely get back okay. to you. All right, thank you. So, so thank okay, you very thank much you for all the. Uh, yeah, thank you. And another question I will have, I want you to also help me clarify. Yes. There's, although probably you might have treated the uh, uh, that section on previous classes, like you when probably I want to make a record, you know, a, a, a tutorial, and I want my just to be reflecting, or I don't want it to be reflected. So I was trying to maneuver. I was unable to get it right. So in that case, Goldweb has a very good feature in the um, Goldweb Control Properties dialog. If you go to the Device tab. There you will find input okay. devices combo box and there you will find loop back. So if you select loop back, okay, loop uh, back. yes, loop back, okay. maybe loop back speaker or loop back real take or something like that. Okay, which particular sound device you are using. Okay. Then whatever coming from the sound device, okay. including your jaws or anything, if you even play some songs from your media player, those all will be recorded. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah. You're Grateful. Good. Thanks for your time and uh, I really. Yeah, I appreciate this tutorial enough. Thank you very much. Gold wave. Okay, so yeah, it's around 9 p.m. I thought to talk to you a little more, but uh, unfortunately, we are out of time. Even I planned, uh, I mean, I thought to demonstrate some more type of voiceover, but unfortunately, the time is limited. Uh, so I'm finally uh, finishing this session. And again, I'm thanking you, everyone for joining me until this whole workshop uh, i have learned a lot while talking to while teaching you i have really enjoyed your company okay and i wish that if i plan anything in the future i'll send you email if you wish to join you can certainly join that and uh, because uh, today is july 25th uh, so it's around one year uh, I am doing this thing virtual workshops for free and uh, so it's a very good opportunity to meet you people and uh, I hope to meet you again in the near future. Thank you everyone and please uh, stay blessed and take care of yourself. Thank you.